What's going down, YouTube? It's your boy, c KJ. You already know, man, we back at it again with another banger for y'all, man. As you guys read in the title, man, you already know what we about to do a comparison video. And in this comparison video, we will be doing velvet durags versus silky durags. As you can see, I got the purple and the gold. Rest in peace, Kobe. All right, we back. So like I said, velvet versus silky durags, man. We, I'm gonna just go into depth about both of these durags and what uh, my personal opinion is on which one is better for your weight. So without any further ado, man, let's get straight into the video. All right, man, we're gonna start out with the most common durag out of both of these, and that is the silky durag. Only other durag that I can think of that's common besides silkies or velvets is a polyester durag, and I'm gonna put a picture up somewhere. But that durag is really looked down upon. That's probably the worst, technically the worst quality you can get. But when it comes to silky do-rags, if you pull the do-rag, you'll see that that pretty much is the same material as the polyester do-rag. So with that said, silk do-rags are not 100% silk. They're more of a satin blend. You gotta, they gotta mix a whole bunch of different materials up to come out with this silky do-rag. Um, but that's the only negative I have about it, really. To me, silk do-rags are the best do-rags for your waves because it keeps it in the moisture in your hair. It doesn't take away the moisture. For me, silky do-rags have better compression than velvet do-rags when you sleep. Um, as you can see right here, I'm wearing a navy blue silky and a, bel and a sorry, a booboo cap on top. But yeah, silky do-rags are real good for keeping in the moisture. Uh, they stay in place better than velvet do-rags. And overall for style, honestly, I like silkies a little bit better because you can get like designer you can get multicolor, two-tone, all those other different types of silky do-rags. And last but not least, in my personal opinion, silky do-rags have your hair looking a little better after you unwrap. So with that said, let's get straight into the velvet do-rags. All right, man, right here we got a velvet do-rag. This is a yellow velvet do-rag. Now, my opinion on velvet do-rags is for style, they look a little better. That's what these do-rags were made for. They were made for style purposes. Um, like it just kind of pops a little more than the regular silky do rag, so that's what these are for. Um, they're not that good for compression, especially when you're sleeping. The inside material is not really like a silky material, so if I were to wear a velvet do rag, I would have a silky under and a velvet on top. Velvet do rags are easier to stretch, so that's why I said the silkies are better to sleep with because. Velvet Durag, if you just go sleep with a velvet, nine times out of 10, it will either unravel a little bit, move around more when you sleep, or just not get that hole like the Silky does, and let alone double compression, Google cap, Silky Durag. You already know the vibe. But I don't want to talk too much down on this Velvet Durag. If you're just going out, you know what I'm saying, for a special event, or you want to make your outfit pop a little more, these are probably better to match with, and they're better for style, like I said, that's what they're made for. And overall, your whole appearance will pop better with a velvet do-rag. So, my personal opinion on both of the do-rags is my winner will be silkies over velvets, just because I take into consideration what will give me the most progress, and for that, I will definitely take silkies over. But I wanted to thank you guys for giving me the 245 subscribers, man. We only on the come up from here. I'm trying to get a professional, more professional camera than rather shooting on my iPhone tomorrow. So I hope good comment, good content definitely coming soon. And I hope this video really helps you guys to choose which do rag you want to use. So make sure to go like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video.